Hello everyone, this is Saeed. Today I'm going to show you how to make chana masala. Uh, simplest way guys. But uh, to make this uh, recipe guys, you have to watch two of my videos. I'm gonna put it on my description link. It's uh, masala paste, the chicken masala paste. And also I'm gonna use service onion uh, here. Uh, I got the video recipe on my, on my channel. It'll be easier for you guys to make it. I mean, make the make the nice and smooth chana masala. So let's start, it guys. Uh, first, I'm going to I'm going to add one chef spoon, which is three tablespoon of cooking oil. And also, I'm going to add less than one teaspoon of um teaspoon of butter ghee sorry now i'm going to add some garlic freshly chopped garlic about one and a half teaspoon then i'm going to add one tablespoon of service onion you can add fresh onion, fresh sea chopped onion as well, as well guys. That's to be finely chopped. If you add finely or finely chopped onion, it's absolutely fine. Now I'm going to add one quarter teaspoon of salt to taste. And I'm going to add some chickpeas. Sorry guys, my video wasn't on. Uh, I added one more tablespoon of uh, onion, service onion. So it's about two tablespoon of um, service onion, guys. Now I will let it cook, guys, till. Right, guys. Now I'm going to add the tomato puree. Tomato puree, guys. I got the video recipe on my on my channel. I'm going to add about half a uh, chef spoon, as you can see. About uh, one, more, uh, two tablespoon, and. Also guys, I got this uh, tomato puree, uh, in the Russian style tomato puree recipe on my channel. With, uh, if, you, if you have a look at my service onion and tomato puree recipe video, uh, you can find it on my channel. I'll put it in the video description. I'm going to add one quarter teaspoon of mixed curry powder. I'm going to add uh, the masala paste. I got the video recipe on my channel for this masala paste. I'm gonna add two teaspoon. And if you wanna add some heat, guys, as well, uh, the masala paste is a bit sweet. But if you wanna add some heat, like uh, paprika or uh, red chili powder, extra hot red chili powder, or Kashmiri chili powder, you can add it. I'll actually add a little bit hot chili powder. I'm adding normal chili powder, guys, one quarter teaspoon. It's hot. About actually two teaspoon, two quarter teaspoon. About half teaspoon. Mix it with the with the chickpeas, guys. With the chickpeas. And if you get to dry, add some. I mean, I'm going to add some tomato, fresh tomato, and also I'm going to add some cream. About one chef spoon. Yes, tomato is actually optional. 
it's if it's up to you if you don't uh, when I add it it's optional guys now guys I'm going to add the gravy about half cup and also I'm going to add some green chili and some fenugreek leaves and some green chilies and some fresh coriander On the low, cooking on the low heat guys mm -hmm. guys my chana masala is almost ready as you can see look at that it's caramelizing as you can see and if you like mild guys you can add uh, you can skip the chili powder add some more cream you can make it more cream creamy uh, you can add more like mm, two chef spoon or three chefs spin of cream but I like it that way the way it is just now I like it like this uh, so if you want creamy masala everything is same it's just don't add chili powder add more cream that's it and if you want more saucy you can add more gravy as well if you want so that's it guys I'm gonna transfer it to one of my serving bowl it's a nice um, side dish or you can have it as a main dish as well guys it's, it's very nice and make sure guys your chickpeas are I mean perfectly cooked if it's not if it's too hard guys then you, you're not gonna enjoy it look look at my chickpeas guys as you can let me show you as you can see it's perfect it's smooth cook your low heat and caramelize it then you, you will like it I'm gonna transfer it to on my serving bowl guys my channel masala is done as you can see thank you very much thanks for watching guys and please like comment and share and if you like my recipe please share with you with your friends and also if you have any question regarding this recipe or any other recipes guys please leave a comment below I will answer as soon as possible that's it thank you so hope to see you soon guys bye bye